I really enjoyed One Royal Holiday. I wasn't 100% sure if I'd love it when it started because one of the protagonists took a little while to become likeable, but actually, I really did enjoy this. This was released originally in 2020. It's directed by Dustin Rickard and it stars Laura Osnes as Anna. And we also have Aaron Tvayat, Tvayat as James. I apologise if I've mispronounced that. I'm sure I have. And Anna encounters, well, who she thinks is just a man and his mother while she's getting donuts and coffee. And unfortunately, because of the weather, they're not able to travel to where they're meant to be going. So she invites them to stay with her family at her family's inn. And the the man, James, I'll talk more about him in a moment, he's reluctant. But his mother, Gabriella, played by Victoria Clark, is actually really warm and really friendly and is very happy to accept this hospitality and they stay there and quite quickly once they arrive Anna learns that James is actually the prince and Gabriella is the queen of a place called Galwick and not everybody around them knows this but a couple of people do but in general the prince and the queen get to act like they're just ordinary people and in doing so, Anna gets to show James what Christmas is like for her. And as you can imagine, Christmas for her and most people is very different to the Christmas that James knows. Now, as I said, one of the protagonists is not very likable to begin with, and that is James. He is very cold. He is kind of rude, actually, and not just in the whole, I'm a prince, my guard is up, I won't let anybody in but in a way that's actually just not very nice and not a nice way to treat people. So I didn't like him for, I don't know, maybe 20 minutes, half an hour. Eventually, I started to warm to him, I guess, as he started to go through this character development. It became easier to like him. Anna, on the other hand, was very likable immediately, and Gabriella, the queen, loved her straight away. So in general, all of the characters are pretty great, James just takes a little bit of getting used to. And because this is largely about Anna welcoming James and Gabriella to her family's inn and showing them what their Christmas is like, that means we do have a lot of festivities. The decorations are gorgeous, obviously because they're snowed in a lot of the time. There's a lot of snow. It's very fresh, very white, very crisp and beautiful to look at. And, and I really enjoyed it. It's definitely one of those films where you do need to suspend disbelief a tiny bit. With some Christmas rom-coms, everything is plausible and makes perfect sense. Sometimes you need to just let go of reality a tiny bit. And that's definitely the case with this film. But if that's not something that you mind doing, then I think you might like it. It was a little slow because of the issues I had with the character of James. But once it got going, actually, it was, it was really sweet and really moving. And I, I had a lot of fun with it. One Royal Holiday is one that uh, I quite enjoyed. And if you haven't seen it and you're into Christmas rom-coms, I definitely recommend you check it out.